Yeah. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Dungeons and Dragons. Here we are playing Dungeons and Dragons, doing some really cool shit. Okay. You guys wake up in the keep. I do not. Except for Yokimi and Isbeth, who are in the woods. Hey. <laughs> so, Yelkin and Joe wake up in the keep. Dude. I'm away. Uh, the festival is, the dragon festival is tomorrow. Well, yes. What do you want to do? Do you have a day before the dragon festival? I'm gonna go get some breakfast. Yeah. Gonna go get some breakfast. Okay, you go downstairs and uh, you get some breakfast. You, you you go to the kitchen and you get some breakfast. It was a male. Um, you do notice that it's really quiet in the in the fact that the Minotaur uh, you has left. Oh yeah. She yeah, left. Yeah. She, she left uh, overnight because her whole party is gone now. Wait, so was she just party there party? without her party? What? Was she just there without her party for a while? Uh, for the last, like, 12 hours. Oh. Uh. Um, well, one of- two of them died, so, I mean... Huh? Wait, two died? Seth died, Seth and... Seth died, and then... And then he killed himself. And then Gurge committed suicide last session. When? When did this happen? Last time. I think I it was after you left last time, because you had to leave. Yeah. Oh, okay, I was so confused. Yeah, yeah this happened after you left. Yeah, J George jumped off the built, jumped off the... To be fair, last time I was very not sober. <laughs> <laughs> uh, where's... I need to remove Yildren from the layout. Because, oh, I should probably say that. Yildren is no longer playing with us, at least for the foreseeable future. Yildren is no longer with us? He's no, yeah, he's no longer. He also jumped. He also jumped from the top of the key. <laughs> oh my god! Oh yeah, there's just the physical... <laughs> it doesn't make those pieces of wood and metal. Just, we picked up those pieces and put them all in the arm leg. Okay, so <laughs> yeah, we together. picked up those pieces and sold them to Gunda. Humpty Dumpty. Humpty Yildren sat on the wall. Humpty Dumpty fell right down. All the Anyways. two horses and all the things, man. Anyways, um, yeah. So, what do you guys want to do? Uh, Yelkin, what did, what are you doing? You wake up. You slept a little bit I more than everyone Twitter. else. You went to sleep a little earlier. Um, I don't know. I don't- I don't know. It is one day- oh, Jess is here, too. She's upstairs still, though. Hi, Jess. So yeah, Jess will come downstairs while you're cooking, Joe. Hey, Joe. Has Yokimi got yeah, back yet? Uh, I thought he was sleeping, I haven't seen him. Oh, he went to the Ethereal Grove last night. Oh yeah, I already told Jess, I didn't tell anyone else. <laughs> hmm. So is Yelkin also in the kitchen now? Just Sure, yeah. So yeah, you guys all three all three of you guys are in the kitchen. Yokimi, what's going on at the Ethereal Grove? Um well after if Ezroth is awake, um I'm just gonna start she heading was, back. She she was up before you. That's not surprising, actually. She went out hunting early in the morning, came back with some rabbit, and is already cooking it on a campfire in the middle of the grove. Uh, she's sitting with Kira when you wake up in the, in the middle of the grove. Hey, guys. Um, I'm gonna go back. You want some rabbit? Ah, oh, fuck it. Rabbit's good. I'll, 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 like, pick up, like, a leg or something. Okay. Uh, you guys chat for a little bit before you and Isbeth start heading back to, uh, to the keep. 
Did you want to say anything to Kira before you left? I'm just gonna give him a hug. Uh, he has no solid form, so your body just goes through. I forgot about that. Well, worth the shot. Anyway, um. Um, Is okay. I'll see you later. You're nah. Yeah, stay safe, mate. And I would say contact me if you need me, but you written, unfortunately, you can't. Well, I mean, I can if you're in the woods. Well, yeah, but I'm unsure how long I'm going, how often I'm going to be in the woods at this point. Okay. Well, if you need me and you're in the woods, do you see all that token I gave you? Yes, I do. Just and throw that in start. the air and then I'll, I'll come if, I, if you're in the woods. A what? Yes. C O N E, Yelkin. I think I still have it at least. Let me quickly check. Uh... Jesus. <laughs> I mean, no, I don't have it. I must have used it, I guess. I don't think you used I don't remember. it. Yeah, I don't remember using it, but Did I don't have it Did you ever put it in your inventory? inventory? I might not have put it in my inventory. Okay, just, we'll, we'll say you still have it. I don't think you used yeah. it. So we heading out then? Yeah. Uh, did you guys just bring your one more bounder, so you guys are sharing a more bounder, right? I bought, I bought my more bounder. I don't okay. think she has a more bounder. She was riding it with you, I think. Yeah. So yeah, you guys head back. So that'll take like a couple hours before you get back. An hour or two. So, Joe and Yelkin, what are you guys doing after you finish breakfast? Joe, what are you doing after you finish breakfast? We're just getting ready, stretched out, you know, sharpening up the weapons, making sure everything is all good, loading all the pistol and crossbow and all that type of stuff. Just make sure everything's ready, waiting for I don't get ready. I'm just out chilling, talking to plants. <laughs> You're talking to Clarence? What is Clarence? No, the talking bird? to plants. P L A N T S. I mean, I guess Clarence can come, but... You haven't talked about Clarence in a long time. He's a bird. He's still a bird? He's a bird. <laughs> He's a bird. Um, so yeah, you, 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 what are you talking to the plants about? Just... small talk? I mean, it's are you hard belittling to big talk the plants? Plant, huh? It's pretty hard to have big talk when you're just kind of a little flower, huh? Are you talking to the plants in the keep? Because there is a little garden in the keep. Yeah. Jess will join you then. Cool. Yeah, I'm just chatting it up. Shooting the shit. <laughs> you know me. So, so yeah, she's just chilling on one of the benches while you're talking to the plants. And then I get in a very heated political argument with a tree. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, the tree with- oh, actually, roll, the, roll a, uh, persuasion check against the tree. Persuasion. One sec. <laughs> this is stupid. Um, it's my persuasion. Um, this is stupid, Yelkin. Remember, it's you, so it's not that stupid. That's a good point. <laughs> uh, my persuasion's plus I'll three. Go uh, 16. Okay, you win the debate against the, <laughs> the argument well, I would against hope so. Plants. plants have no knowledge of anything. They aren't sentient. Well, I wanted to roll to see if the plant beat you in. <laughs> plants are sentient. Roll. They can talk to you. No, no, no. Roll it. I did roll. Oh, what'd you get? A 12. <laughs> Stupid fucking plant. He, he brought up some good points. Jess is just watching you argue with this plant. Then I'm absolutely destroying him. I'm on my bitch of Vera. 
Wait, can she can she talk to plants? Again? His ass. No, she can't talk to plants. I used to. And then I stole it. <laughs> yeah, she used to with her best like and then you, you took it. And then I was it was it was given to me gracefully. Yeah, it was given to you. Um Yeah. <laughs> anyways, so you talk to the plants. Joe, what are you doing after you eat breakfast? You were sharpening your tools and stuff, so by the time you guys finish those things, your team gets back. I'm looking for Yelkin. Me? You find Yelkin and Jess in the, the <laughs> garden. You find Yelkin screaming at the top of his voice at a lily. I, I, I'm going to throw um, his shield at his head. Okay, you have his shield, I forgot. I have his shield. You have my shield? One. I have your shield. So one you got commissioned. Yeah. Oh, my new letter man. Yeah, you're letter man. Hugging. Does it bounce off and come back to you? Was that pretty cool? No. No, it's just gonna hit over the (laughs) mouth. There's a there's a twenty one hit. There's a twenty one hit. We're gonna see if you do that. And um, it hits. Oh wait, no, I don't have shield. Never mind. I thought I had shield. Y'all can you take two points of bludgeoning damage as the shield hits you in the head? <laughs> All right, great start for the day. <laughs> right, how many points of damage again? Two. Two? Okay. Yeah. Uh, Yokimi just gives you a hug when she sees you. I'll give her a hug back. How was your trip? It was good. He is doing a lot better. <laughs> That's good. He's actually been able to sleep now, which is both worrying and good at the same time. Yeah, that's good. For sure. Uh, Isbeth is going to join. Joe, are you still in the kitchen? So, like, the the training room, certain kind of stuff. So, Isbeth is going to come upstairs then. I think it's top floor, right? Yeah. Yeah, to where you are. Wait, did you say that you left? By the way. Yes. Oh shit. You left. Uh, so, Isbeth, no Isbeth might just stick around with you guys for a while. We'll see. Is Isbeth no? Isbeth no what? So, who was it? What was it? Isbeth. The name. Oh, Isbeth, Isbeth, Isbeth was yeah. Isbeth was no. Yeah. Okay. Let's say that. I have a question. Yeah. So, my shield is adamantine, right? Yeah, it's a plus one adamantine shield. Okay, cool. So, it's a plus one shield and you can't get crit. Lit. Thank you. Where's this? Here's this character shield. I'm gonna crazy. Okay. Throw in a yellow spot. So, yeah, Ismith is head. going to, to practice shoot it, shooting some arrows at the uh, at the dummies, too, while you're... While you're, um... Practicing, she's also going to practice. She's a very good shot. You notice this almost immediately how accurate her arrows are. Nice. Nice shot. Uh, try aiming a little bit, a little bit there. Yeah, a little bit to that side. She hits try exactly where you're, where you were telling her the aim. It's very impressive. Just try and hit this. I'm gonna toss it up and toss a piece of my armor in the air. Okay. She misses. <laughs> oh, well, we're gonna, we're, gonna work on the, we're gonna work on the moving targets. Damn it. Sorry. Actually, no, she's gonna take two shots at it while it's in the air. So, see if one. No, she, both of them miss. <laughs> but you do see Sorry, two arrows, cool. and they, they go. One goes to each side. She lets loose two arrows. One goes to either side of the the thing you threw in the air. Oh man, so a little bit bigger would have that one. Would have had it. Yeah, you gotta practice those flying, flying arrows for these dragons. You never know if they're gonna go up in the air or not. Mm-hmm. Can you fly? Hmm? Can you fly? Can I fly? Yeah. No, I can't fly. Um, I, don't like it. I can't do anything quite like that. Oh, 
Oh, right. Her dexterity is not very high. Her stats aren't very good. Forgot about that. Okay, um... Is there anything else we need... Joe, do you know if there's anything else we needed to do to prepare for the festival? Um, I don't think so. I'm gonna buy a couple health potions on the way out of the town. I'll go with you if you want. So, yeah, I just figured we stop at a booth on the way. Some, there's gotta be a booth someone's selling in the festival. A couple of spare. I mean, I'm sure, I'm sure we could go to the, um, shoot, what's the name of the. Forget the name of the, the, the shop. Shoot, did I write it down? I don't know if I wrote it down. The, uh, giant shop? Yeah. Um. It's been a while. Oh, uh, what? The top of the. The heap. The, the, the big guy. The, bio. the general store. Like but it's spelled. Yeah. I think it's called. I think it was general store, but it was spelled wrong or something. Oh, yes, it was yeah. general snore. That's what it was. Yeah. <laughs> the general snore. So you're gonna. Uh, so yeah, it's just like. I think there's some. Um, uh, we'd probably get some health potions at the general store. Can I hope he's open on... Um... Last time we bought a health potion from there, didn't we get a, like, a potion that made somebody glitter or something? I don't remember. Maybe? I'm pretty sure that happened. Actually, no, I think it was like a water breathing potion. <laughs> yeah, we got a water breathing potion last time. I don't know where, where I got glitter from, but... <laughs> no, that's a great idea. You guys still have Oasis Water too, don't you? What? Yeah, we still have a lot of Oasis Water. Is anyone gonna drink some Oasis Water on this fine morning? I'm the only person that has- I'm the one that has all the Oasis Water. It's in my bag of holding. Hello, guys. Is anyone gonna drink some Oasis Water? No. It's in my- I'm it's in my ba- it's in my bag of holding. How the fuck are you guessing? Yo, Kimi, are you going to drink some Oasis water? No, not at the moment. It sounds like DM might want you to drink some Oasis water. <laughs> I just yeah, like you to my table. Yeah. Anyway, if you die, I'll try to help. <laughs> By the way, I'm only here till one. I have to per- help a cousin move today. Okay. Oh, good. I can't um, find our game in my games on Roll20. What do you mean Roll20? We use D&D Beyond. Well, that's right, we don't have a Roll20. We do, but we don't use it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we're all here right now. Anyways. Um, so, Joe and Isbeth are going to the general snore. Uh, Yaz wakes up a little bit later than everyone else. Yaz, you wake up uh, to Yokimi getting back uh, from... You don't know where, because he didn't tell anyone where he was going. Wait, I'll tell you. When he, as he comes in. I don't. I just stay in my tower and start working on stuff. Reading books or something. Okay. And tomorrow is the is the Dragon Festival. Okay. Um. So, Joe and Isabeth get to the general store. How could I help you today? What can I do for you? Looking for a couple of health potions. Well, you're looking for potions. Let me look for you. This is already a health, health potions. Um, here is potion. He puts a potion of a, a blue, uh, a blue glittering potion on the table. This is gonna turn him into glitter. It, it should, it should be a red potion. Looking for health potion. Red potion. Let me check again. <laughs> red glittering potion. <laughs> Uh, he puts Quick a green, he puts resistance. a green, a green potion on the table. Red potion. <laughs> <Violet acid. laughs> 
character development. One in twenty minutes. Oh That's wait, better. this is green. Let me look again. <laughs> oh, so he's not colorblind. He puts a, uh, another green potion on- or no, this time he puts a brown potion on the table. That's not red. Uh, you're getting closer, but it's still not that one's quite. Actually just, that one's just mud. <laughs> <laughs> hold on, hold on, let me, let me it's check a, it's again. It's a base potion, it's called copy. <laughs> let me check again. Um, he puts a, like, a gray, a, a gray with a bluish tint potion on the table. No way, you no, that's not red. That's not red either. Um... What if this you is the potion? Another, another, you another, another green potion on the table. No. Potion of death knife. Uh, he puts another green potion on the table. He keeps looking for potions. I put another green potion on the table. Just take one when he turns he around. He puts another green potion on the table, and then he eventually finds a red, a red glittering potion. So there's just all these different sitting on the table now. Sorry guys. I've got some pink eye going on and I can't hardly see the screen and I'm not okay. uh, I'm not feeling good. I'm not feeling it today. Okay. Oh good man. Bye guys. See you guys. Later. Later. Get better. Okay. So yeah, there's um there's And there was three. He found the potion eventually. It looks like the right kind of glittering. It looks like a red glittering potion. It doesn't look, look, it, look quite the same as the other healing potions you've seen. <sighs> but it looks close enough. Fuck's sake, Yelkin. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't. It's just something that he sent for me. I DM them. <laughs> um, well, there's one. Do you have, do you have another one? I was going to get two potions, just in case. How, how much for this one? Uh, the 100 gold. No, wait, no. 50 gold. 50, okay. Oh, you got another one? I can sure look. Let me look. Yes. He puts another one on the table. Alright. Uh, for, so, for 50 gold, do you give me these? Um, since you're such loyal customers, 80 for both. Deal. Yeah. Uh, add two potions of greater. Add two potions of greater healing to your inventory. Oh. Hey. <laughs> uh, greater healing and sparkle. <laughs> Wait, you say potions of greater healing? <laughs> yeah. Jesus. Why am I not finding one here? Do you want to buy any of the other potions? Um. Wait, I don't see greater healing on here. Oh, there it is. I'll, I'll buy. I'll, I'll, how much for these green ones? Oh, that'll be that'll be twenty five gold. I'll buy. I'll buy two of those. The only times it was two browns and a blue. Um, so there's there was four green ones, two browns, and a blue. How much for these other ones? I don't know what they are, but each twenty five gold. I'm crazy. Why not? Twenty five, seventy five more. So Just you're gonna buy, you're gonna buy both the brown um, ones and the blue one. Yeah. 
What about just the taking two? The what about the other two green ones? Do you want to buy the, either of the two green ones too? I don't know whether there's green or not four. I was four, and she's buying two of them. Oh, she only bought two of the four. I thought she was getting all of them. Nah. Um. Hey, I mean, if you're selling them, I suppose I might as well buy them. Okay. Um. So you can add two potions of animal friendship, two potions of growth, and one potion of water breathing. Potions of growth. Animal friendship, is that what you said? Yeah. <laughs> Water breathing? Yep. Gross. Oh, you're kidding me. I literally. <laughs> that was simultaneous. You can save minds, guy. <laughs> What did you do? Save mines. <laughs> the moment I picked the guy's phone, Viagra, and then just not try. That's a good one, Phil. Potion. Just Viagra. Haha, very funny. Yeah. It is very funny. One blue one. Two browns. The brown, I guess, was growth. Yeah. The brown was growth, the blue was water breathing, and the green was animal friendship. I don't know if she might already have had it, the animal friendships. No, she has speak with animals. Yeah. This is repulsive. Do you need anything else? <laughs> Jesus Christ, Yoko! <laughs> do you do you need anything else? Um, I think I'm okay. I, think. I have lots of things. Are you sure you don't want more things? I mean, I love more things, so that's not why I want to spend my money on it. Okay. Got anything for free? <laughs> um, for a loyal customer, let me check. Yeah, I buy from I buy things from here a lot, so you should give me things that I don't have to buy. I've got I've got the scroll. Oh. Take it, take it, take it. Natural doll. It's a scroll. <laughs> oh, a scroll. Should I take a scroll? Uh, he hands you the scroll. You can add a. Spell scroll first level to your inventory. It's a spell scroll of shield. Oh, nice. Yelkin, it sounds like you're causing trouble. I don't know what you mean. I don't know. That's just like, that's 26 AC. Twenty-six AC for you. Yeah, if I got shield, that'd be twenty-six AC. Jesus. Including your new plus one shield, or without? That? Yeah, including because yeah. now including the shield, it's twenty-one. Nice. Do you want there to we buy go. other things? <laughs> we might start running out once the festival starts. Dude, Jerry, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be going to the general store soon anyway. You mean the general snore? Yeah, general you snore. Mean the brown growth. <laughs> <laughs> That's so unfunny. Can, you need to go to sleep. <laughs> That's not funny. Stop laughing. You need to take a long Wait, rest. Kid, you, you need to sleep. You need to take That's a long funny. rest. It sounds like you have Stop a point laughing. of exhaustion. <laughs> He's got two. <laughs> I've definitely got disadvantage on charisma checks, that's for sure. And wisdom saves. Cause I can't stop talking about brown growth. Uh, uh, anyway, um, so Yokimi, Yalkin, what are you guys doing? Well, um, Joe's at the general yeah, store. Well, I was going to go to the general store, cause I'm gonna try and so, sell my guns. So, Joe, when you're leaving, Yokimi walks in. Oh, hi, Joe. Hey, he's like a good day. Yeah. Yeah. 
Uh, you just have to get a shout out to see when the festival goes, so. Ah. I also wanted to go to the general store. Okay, so you go, you, y'all can go to the Kimi then. Oh, hello, valued oh. customers. How can I help you today? Alright. Two things. One, I pull out a gun. I pull out a pistol. Do you have a shiny version of this? Shiny, I'll pull out a gun. Shiny money. gun. Hmm. Let me check for shiny gun. And then I pull out my gun and I go, this is a robbery. <laughs> no. Oh, no. <laughs> I do not no. have a shiny gun. We do not oh, ask okay. They're not very uh, common outside of outside of pirate land, so they're kind of hard. That, that, that's why um, I, I put the gun back into my bag of holding, and I, I put the sh pull my shield off my bag. Do you have a shiny version of this? Shiny, shiny shield. Room. Let me check. No. Damn. Um. Yeah. I heard there's a new backsmith in town. Maybe he could help you. Yeah. I, 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 yeah, he probably could. Well, thank you. Okay. Goodbye. Um, oh, yeah. Um, how much would you give me for these? I pull out three pistols and put them on the desk. I give you 100 gold. For all of them, or each? All of them. Uh. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm gonna trade them for other things. Thank you. Oh, um, I, could, I put them in my bag of holding. I could give you this... He, ha he holds out a, um, an orb. For one gun, give you this. Ah, fuck it. I, I give him a gun. I okay, give him a pistol. Add, add, a drift <laughs> add a drift globe to your inventory. A drift globe? You just gave an idiot a gun. Yep. He starts fiddling with the gun and accidentally you forgot to take the ammo out and he shoots the top of the roof. Huh. Ooh, I should be more careful with that. Oopsie poopsies. There's no way I, I a, a thing just said that. I was gonna say human being, but. <laughs> well, he did. There's no way a being just said that. <laughs> and what about you, my good sir? Fellow big man. Hello, big man. Uh, I, don't, I forgot why I was here. <laughs> I forgot. Are you looking for something in particular, or would you like me to look inside my magic box or pile? And look inside your magic box, please. Okay, he looks inside the pile. Okay. Uh, and he pulls out. A scroll. Mm -hmm. I'm listening. Well, my do you want me to keep looking inside pile or can I look at the scroll? Yeah, you could look at scroll. He hands you the scroll. Do I know anything about it? Hold on. Uh, yeah, it's a spell scroll sending. That's that's. Useless. Is it useful? Is it useless? Well, it, it's useful, but it's also useless. It seems like it would help. I mean, in what or situation are we going to use a scroll of sending? In what situation? Yeah, that's gonna learn it too. Most scrolls. That's I the whole sell, point of scrolls. I sell you for 125 gold. This, this is just a piece of paper, dude. How is this worth 125 gold? It's spell scroll. 
Do you even know what these words mean? You don't know how to read, neither do I. This is just a piece of paper. This is just a plant that was bleached. Tell you what. Bleached plant. Tell you what. Tell you what, tell you what I'll, give you, I'll give you 70. Mm, roll a persuasion check. Okay. One second. <laughs> That's a four, but I'm gonna use a luck point. That's a three. That's a seventeen. Use... Ooh. It's a what? A seventeen. Eighty gold. Seventy-five. Roll another persuasion check. <laughs> really. <laughs> Okay. His first offer, by the way, was actually a pretty good deal for a third level scroll. Yeah, so I mean his third level, so it was actually quite good. <clears throat> God, that's... You know what, I'm just gonna not use a luck point on that, because I rolled a five. 80 or no deal. You got it. You got it. Okay. We could probably... We should probably give that to Yaz. Do you want me to check oh, Smile no, again for more things, or is that all you need? Yeah, 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 just one more time. Okay. I'm using the, uh, I'm now using the, the random magic items tables and the DMG every time he pulls out a scroll, or an uh, item out of a... I have this potion. Mm-hmm. It looks like it's the same, it looks the same as the potion Joe just bought. I sell you for... 50 gold. Which potion Joe just bought? He bought like 7. The healing potion. Uh, what did he say? 50, 50 gold. gold. Yeah, okay. You buy? Yeah. Okay, add a potion of greater healing to your inventory. Alright. Yo, Kimi, do you want, do you want him to search for an item for you too? Oh, fuck it. I'll, I'll take, I'll, I'll take one item from the pile of magic items. Okay. I like rolling on tables, it's always fun. Random tables are always yeah. fun. Uh, I got- he pulls out a regular potion of healing. I will sell you this for... 30 gold. 25. Roll persuasion check. Damn, I'm trying to get it at normal price. I think normal I know, price for a regular 50, potion of healing is 50 gold. Yeah, I'm thinking of lesser. Um, but yeah, persuasion I can do. Uh, what did he, I said thirty or forty just now? You said thirty, and I said twenty-five. Yeah. Um, twenty-two. How do I have plus five to persuasion? The fuck? You got a what? I don't know how I have plus five to persuasion, but what apparently you, I do. What did you roll? Um, twenty-two. Um, okay, twenty-seven. Ah, fuck it. Uh... Drive a hard bargain. I, 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 I give him twenty-six gold. I give him two platinum, six gold, eight silver, and eight copper. I don't even know He's... if I can do that math properly. <laughs> it's not right. It's it's um. It's twelve copper it's... short. Yeah. He takes it. That's a lot more coins. It's there's no way. <laughs> it's the right amount. <laughs> Actually, it's gonna... more than the right amount. There's no uh, coins. Jess will also will also buy something from him because I like rolling on the tables. <laughs> Yeah, she'll buy that. She, she buys she buys an uh a like a blackish bubbling potion. Can I step back in? There's a rain outside. <laughs> yeah, you can step back in. Hey, uh, can I trade this chain mail for one of your items? <laughs> Not even trade. Sure, sure, yeah. Uh, just, just since you guys are such loyal customers, um, yes, I will pull one item out of my 
bag for that chain mail, out of my pile for that chain mail, and no matter what it is, I will trade it for that chain mail. Sound good? Good. Yeah. So we're gambling now. <laughs> yep, we're gambling. Ugh. Okay. Here we go. Ooh, this is going to be good. Joe might have just made a very large profit. Oh. <laughs> More like, okay, yeah. He gives you um, a little bundle of, or a little bag and hands it to you. It's Coke. Add, <laughs> add 20 plus 3 bullets to your inventory. Yum. 20 plus 3. Is that 23 Please. bullets? No, 20 plus 3. Oh, yeah. oh, ammunition yeah, plus it. 3. Yeah. I get it. Yeah, uh, so. How, how I'm doing this, every time he pulls an item out, I'm rolling a d4 to see what table between the first four tables and the, D, and the uh, DMG, and then rolling the d100 from there. And that was a, um, that was on table D, which is one of the better tables. So. Well, I should actually be doing all the tables. Sure, once for big which table you're going to use. I should be doing more tables than the first four. So, do you guys want to buy anything else? Would you like to buy anything else? Would you like to buy anything? Oh yeah, how much would this sell for? I pull out my jewel, the bear jewelry that I got from the sunken ship. I will trade you for a random item. <laughs> no, I, 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 I'm sorry. I let's, get this, let's get this. I have an idea. Trade for two random items. I'm only doing this because I like you guys, and you guys have been very good to me. Most people are mean and call me bad names. But I mean, like, at some point, you have to recognize that I one will thing's trade value each of you one of your yeah. items for random item. When you think about it, jewelry is just a bunch of little small items connected together. And where your jewelry? I, 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 I pull out a, um, a, a longbow. What about this? That will do. Cool. I have two longbows. I don't know how I have two, but I have two. of storm giant strength. Ooh. Could be useful. Could be useful. Will be useful, definitely. Um, Jess will give him... Uh... Pawning <laughs> off all her items that we Jess don't will need. Give him, Jess will give him her, her liar that she never uses. I just got a legendary potion. The boy now. Oh, there's a fingernail inside of the potion. Ah. Uh, um. What the is there a nail in the potion? There's a silver fingernail um, in the potion. Just gets a that. stone, an ion stone. I don't know what that is. Ion stone. I sound great. Those are the ones that give you a plus one in a stack category. It's the Ion Stone of Leadership? <laughs> no, Ion Stone of Intelligence. Ion Stone of Intelligence. They have a plus one intelligence, but it goes dormant for 200 years. Can't use it again. I think. Well, I'm thinking. When you use an action, oh, the blood. toss one of these stones in the air. Orbits around your head. There was some different. Um. Oh, it does. It does do what you said, but it also does other things. So she'll tune to that, which increases her intelligence by two. Which one is she? Intelligence. 
protection awareness. I should have given that to me. So when you use Wait, an action, to, she can use an action to toss the stone into the air. Um, another creature must use their action to grasp or net the stone to separate it from you. Either making a successful AC 24 or DC 24 athletics. Or sorry, acrobatics. Um, a, the stone has 24 AC, 10 hit points, is resistance to all damage types. Why'd they give it resistance to all damage types and 10, 10 health if they could have just given it 20 health? That's a good point. I don't know. Cause mending. Yeah. Anyways, I want to give him my moon touched sword. Hey, I told you that. Yeah, and I'm about to get the money back. Fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, you give him the sword. Doesn't move touch the sword. And he gives you. I don't know. I have some sort of great. Qual's feather token. A what? Qual's feather token. What is that? Q U A A L apostrophe S feather token. Which token? I'll have to roll for anchor, that. Anchor, bird, fan, swan, fan. tree, whip. Fan. Fan? Let's do. If you are on a boat or a ship, you can use an action to toss the token up to 10 feet in the air. The token disappears and a giant flapping fan takes its place. The fan floats and creates a wind strong enough to fill the sails of one ship, increasing its speed by 5 miles per hour for 8 hours. You can dismiss the fan as an action. Literally, what is this? I, I will also say that it'll work on a skyship, too. Okay. We need to buy a skyship. <laughs> we do need to yes. buy a skyship. And, and, as, and as a bonus, because I like you guys so much, I will give you one extra bonus item on the house. <laughs> oh. <laughs> He get, hands you guys another spell scroll mm -hmm. of Cure Wounds. Mm. So first level spell scroll of Cure Wounds. Whoever wants to take that can take that. I have I Cure Wounds as a spell, so I won't take that. I also have Cure Wounds as a spell, actually. So I Joe, don't. you can take that. I'll take Cure Wounds as a spell. First level? Yeah. Yeah. Because I don't think you can actually get the actual level. Do you guys want Why to buy? I, I, I will. Uh, if you guys ever want to come back here, I will do random pullings out of my pile for three hundred gold. You just made D and D Genshin Impact. So you ever want to buy anything? Okay. Okay. And you and you can have one reroll. Say that again. One sure. reroll. One reroll. So three hundred gold re -roll gives you two chances. Gives you two chances. Can I use my reroll? No, on my you, have to pay, you have to pay to get my magic loot box pile. Dude. <laughs> Would you like to play loot, loot, loot box game? My I, transactions. I do not have enough money. Um, I'm going I to go to. I'm going to go to um, Entus. Goodbye, guys. I I walk out the door. Jess will go with you. Hey. And actually, I think Isbeth will also go with you. Yeah, I'm a follow as well. I'll go there. Don't, don't, don't really oh, go every, for okay, everyone's following me then. Okay. Everyone's going to Andrews. Just, 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 you walk out, we just walk out behind you. I sit inside the inside the general snore for like a second too long, just kind of staring at the guy behind the counter. <laughs> there's no counter, there's just him in a pile of, <laughs> of shit. <laughs> it's just him? Uh, yeah, there's him and then it's like one of those fold out tables. <laughs> <laughs> it's a pile of stuff. Is there a roof over his head? Yes, it's an actual I'm building, but the only thing in the building is a, a fold out table and a pile of junk. <laughs> this isn't a general store, this is a yard sale. <laughs> no, it's a general store. It's a yard sale. 
General Snore. Sure. The General Snore. I'm aware. <laughs> so you guys all went to entrances? Yeah. It's yeah. not a General Snore, it's the General Snore. The General Snore. <laughs> this is the best thing I've ever created. Oh, I love it. <laughs> this is this is second only to Grack Grunk. True. Not the dog, the goblin. Wait, wasn't Grack Grunk in the general snore? No. 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 He was at the top. No, he's at the other bar. He's at Kevin's oh, bar. Oh, he's at Kevin's bar. Anyways, so you guys arrive at Entis' place. What can I do for you guys? Right. I need a good shield. Uh, he gives Jess a hug when you come in. Oh, uh, good. Uh, I can make you a shield. Cool. Um, I have something in mind, but I'll need 500 gold. Um, I, I pull out the jewelry. Will this cover it? <laughs> so it's it's worth 1500. Yeah, I can. I can do that. Cool. I, I, I give him the jewelry. It'll be tomorrow. I can get it done. Actually, hold on. Let me see if I have a shield in the back. Yeah, it'll take me about a day to make a shield like that. Okay. Um, thank you. We can stop it on the way out of town to the festival. Uh, so you know this shield isn't going to be what you were looking for, but I think you'll like it. I, I'm looking for anything that either makes my AC better, or it's just cool. Uh, it, this will do both. Ooh! It's an air shield, right? Uh, this is a, something that I just came up with when Yokimi said he wanted a magical shield. Hey. <laughs> okay. Um... What do you guys want to do now? Or did y y you guys want to buy something from Entis too? Oh, yeah. um, anyway. Also, Entis, how much would it cost to turn bullets into silver bullets or make silver bullets? Um, to coat something in. I could coat your bullets in silver. Good uh, gold a piece per bullet. A gold per bullet. Yeah. Right. Um, I, pu I pull out three platinum. This is the rest of my gold. I really need this. So... Um, I mean, I, I the jewelry you gave platinum. me is worth... is worth more than the shield. Yeah, I know. So, I mean, I could just use the rest of that and coat your bullets for you. Yeah, that works. Um, how many bullets do I have? Where are my bullets? Mm -hmm. I don't lean down in your Kimi's ear and just go, hey, do you need a loan? <laughs> what? Can I lean down in your Kimi's ear very far, four feet down into your Kimi's ear and just go, do you need a loan? <laughs> uh, no, I'm, I'm fine. Um, wait, do I not have any bullets in my inventory? I do. I have 50 bullets. I have a lot. So. Yeah, you gave me 50. I did give you 50. So that's, that would be 50 gold, so that 30, or, well, wait, oh, no, yeah, that'll still cover it. Yeah. The, the jewelry will still cover it. You got anything else on that, uh, credit? Because I have a bunch of bullets. Um, I mean, he didn't give me raw money, so that, I'm just being generous with yeah, that's a good point. Do you have Do you have any any gold on you? I could coat more bullets for you. No, I, I don't need silver bullets. If I got if that if me saying that worked out, I was just gonna give the oh. the bullets to him. Thank you. Okay. Well, do you guys need anything else, Joe? Um. Joe? I don't think so. Okay. Do you have anything silver in stock right now? Hmm. <laughs> Do you have any silver weapons in stock right now? I mean, I can silver anything. It's not that difficult. Joe, um, 
The only reason why I'm looking for silvered bullets is because my gun isn't magical. Ma magical weapons will work just fine. So, your sword... Yeah, yes I do, yeah. Yeah, your sword and your Eldritch Blast will be just fine. Do you guys, Ooh, do you guys, do you guys, need, do you guys need any, any, like, and do you want me to do any enchanting or something like that? How about a crossbow upgrade? Do you do work with wood? I mean, I could work with crossbow. It would what does make a crossbow in this situation? Yeah, let me see what I can do. Come back tomorrow. Actually, give me, give me a few minutes. I'll be right back. He goes into the back. Uh, you hear some, some noises coming from the back. So how are you guys doing today? One of the goblins walks up to you and talks to you well. Well, Entis is I forgot on. about this. I forgot. <laughs> I'm uh, we're, we're pretty good, I think. Yeah, yeah she's pretty good. Goblin sinks down into the ground and crisscross applesauces with his hands. Wow, so upset. <laughs> Cheese platter. You want a cookie? Or no. doves? Yeah. We got. Yeah. We got. Here's the cookie. Oh, nice. uh, the master says that it will cost um twenty five gold for your crossbow thing. Nice. You have a tool. You know this. Oh, he said when he passed us in the back. <laughs> Um, okay, he comes back with the with the with the bow, um, and it has a rune carved into the side of it now. Um, uh, equal to your proficiency bonus for a long rest with the crossbow. Now, um, whenever you uh, you can choose when you shoot it to have the spell activate, uh, and it puts a third level uh, armor back this time. You can use that number of times you can use when you shoot the crossbow. That's nice. It puts it on cool. me. I'm the person I hit with it. It puts it on you. Oh, okay. I was like, when I shoot my teammates, you go, I know you. So, so you shoot it, and then this, this oh, icy armor keeps I'm going. I'm never surprised. <laughs> no, like, and I give him the gun. Yeah. The gun? My gun? What do you? What is there anything particular you want me to do with this? No, not really. Just that looks cool. I've got something in mind. Um, uh, two hundred gold. That would yeah. Um, he comes back and uh, now whenever you shoot uh the crossbow, you can them. choose. It has a fire rune on it. And now, whenever you shoot the crossbow, you can choose to use a, to use it as the as the firebolts can trip instead of bullets. So you don't have to use bullets anymore. You can just cast firebolt through the gun. I'm sorry. You, you now have just cast yeah, firebolts so... through the gun and yeah, using you... bullets. <laughs> yeah, yeah, cool, 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 cool. Cool. And you don't have firebolt to load it. So, so yeah, you just cast the firebolts can trip. Cool. So yeah, you basically you've just learned the fireball cantrip. Pretty nice. That's but you sick. have to use the gun in order to use the fireball cantrip. Yeah, yeah. Which I'm I'm not gonna use the gun a whole lot anyways. But um, and you neither neither those neither of those items require an attunement slot. What did you say, you can? Do you want to switch guns then? Are you going to use your gun a lot? When I you just... I sold your bullets, and now you want a gun that doesn't shoot bullets? Well, no, because I can still use the bullets. And it, the okay. silver bullets are still yeah, even more choose, than... you can choose to use firebolt instead of the normal gun. Uh, I'm probably going to use it more often than you, because I can fly. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, <laughs> this would. Cool. I have... I still have... I still have two normal guns, Jesus Christ. So yeah, you you now have uh, someone who not not only do you know a blacksmith, um, but you also know it's also someone who can enchant weapons with runes. So. Yeah, 
Um, I need to give myself a feature just so that I can get the. I think you can just add a magic item that gives you the fireball cantrip. So do keep in mind you do have to have the gun out. If you if you get the sharpshooter feet or have the archery fighting style, those will apply to your role to your you can use those on the fire character. I, I have the gunner feet. feet. Um so yeah, you won't have disadvantage at range when using the uh, yeah. Uh, I made two cool things off the top of my head today. Um, and you can go ahead and add the, uh, the shield to your inventory so you just won't have it until the morning. Uh, it's a shield that can cast the shield spell a number of times equal to your proficiency bonus for long rest. Nice. Shield of shieldiness. So it's a shield that has a shield room carved into it. So I can cast shield. Nice. That's actually really cool. Uh, it's shield is really wait, big. Oh, wait, did you say that again because I couldn't hear you properly anyway? Uh, once per- it can cast it a number of times equal to your proficiency bonus for long rest. Nice. All the- unless they're cantrips, all of the rune spells are going to be proficiency bonus for long rest. Okay. Do you guys want to buy anything else? Get anything else enchanted? Or are you good? I'm good. It's approaching. I'm it's approaching mid afternoon. It's like one p.m. now. Oh, Isbeth is actually going to get a rune put on her sword, or not her sword, on her bow. Um. Actually, no, she's not. She doesn't need any. You guys don't need anything else? Uh, is that all you need? Yeah, I mean, I'm good. Um, he hugs Jess um, and rustles her hair and looks at Yokimi. You take care of my daughter, okay? I did say I would. Don't worry. Otherwise, I'll kill you. Yeah, it won't come to that. <laughs> If I can't protect her, it's probably because I'm already dead. Okay. Well, I'll see you guys at the festival then. Then you guys leave, I assume? Uh, yeah. Yeah, as I'm walking out, I'm gonna turn around and do that thing where you point at my- I point at my eyes and I point- Oh, the memes. You do, wait, you do what? I point at my eyes. I do the thing where you point at your eyes and you point at their eyes. To who? To Intus. No. He looks, like you, he looks at you confused. He should be. <laughs> Good. <laughs> so where are you guys going to go now? I think this is the first time for downtime that the whole group has stayed together. I don't think I have anything else left to do except for do any further thing. Yeah. There is still a week before the actual Dragon Games. It's just the, the, the festival itself starts tomorrow. <laughs> so there's nothing else you guys want to do? You don't want to go talk to Pogto or uh I'm assuming you don't want to go talk to, um, to what's his name, to, shoot, why am I for you, why do I always blank on his name, Zorlis? Um, I'm just gonna go with, um, wherever Jess goes. She's gonna go wherever you go, so. 
or wherever the rest of the party goes, I guess. So you don't want to you don't want to go talk to Pogto or Zorlis. You just want to go back to the keep. Yeah, I'm going to go back and do some research on dragons. You know, some find some vital spots, maybe, or... Okay. You know, so you know. do you guys plan on enjoying yourself during the actual festival until the hunt starts? Yeah. Okay, so we'll just skip. We'll just skip to the next day, then. Um, it was probably the best night's sleep you guys have had in a while. Um, Yaz had just been up in his tower this entire time. Um, I'm assuming you stay in this room again, Yokimi. Yep. So yeah, you guys you guys have a nice rest as well. Uh, everyone just sleeps great. Nothing happens of note of, throughout the night. And it's nice to be home. And you wake up to festival sounds coming from outside. Oh, the parade, the parade, come on, wake up, everyone's the parade. I hear him, I hear him right outside. Disney World? Yeah, the parade's going through. I'm, I run through and knock on everyone's doors. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to keep upstairs. No, 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 Have, you been, have you been to the, uh, to the Dragon Festival before, Joe? Uh, no, I don't think, I, I haven't left, um... Uh, I think it was a little blue topaz. So you haven't, you, you haven't, so you haven't ever been to Golden Rock before the campaign started? No. No. Okay. Yeah, in the pits. He grew up in the pits. Okay. So yeah, there's, there, there is a parade. There's a bunch of carnival games up now. There's vendors from all over. <laughs> Um, and there's a whole lot of people here. Uh, there's actually a few people, a few, a few people have stopped and looked at your keep, like, what the heck is this thing? That's the right thing they're knocking at those doors when I get to the very top to Yaz, I'm gonna go to the battle mount and look over at everything. Yaz doesn't come out, though. But you see a whole, you see crowds, you see the parade going through. They've got, you know how like at the Chinese New Year, they've got that dragon? So there's like a gold yeah. dragon version of that. I'm just waving to everyone from the top. Yay! And there's a few younger gold dragons flying up in the air above the city. And you see some carnival games and stuff too. All sorts of things to do. Do you want, do you want to go enjoy yourself now? Yeah, I'm going down to knock on door again on the way back downstairs. Uh, Isbeth came out with you the first time. That's one person that I will say definitely came out and joined you. She, 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 put, she puts her bow onto, as she's leaving her door, she puts her bow onto her back. She seems just as excited about this as you are. Does she have a bow man, so I'm to put her up on my shoulders like a little child. Okay. We're saying they're waiting. Does anyone else open their come out when Joe knocks on the door? The second time I guess? Um, me, me and Jess would. Okay. Well, I'm not. <laughs> so, yeah, he's got the girl can sleep through it. Looking just to sleep. Yelkin, Yelkin, Yelkin come school. out! The festival started! Jess starts banging on your door. I'm just gonna whisper to his head. The door falls down. As Jess headbutts it. Can I send a whisper into his room? Oh, Y'all can wake up. This festival's going on. Y'all can, y'all can wake oh, up! The festival! Is it I'm, I, I hit Joe as hard as I can. <laughs> you hit him? Uh, right. I'm right, outside right. your room. Jess isn't outside <laughs> your room, so do you hit Jess? Wait, what? You hit Jess, is, Jess is jumping up and down next to your bed yelling your name. I thought Joe was in my room. No, Joe is in the outside room. Jess is down the door. No, I don't hit Jess. He swings. I guess. 
Are you really? sure you don't hit Jess? I'm trying to see if there's something I could do that's funny but not mean. It would be funny. She hits you back. You hit Jess? You won't hit um, let, me, let me read through my spells real quick. <laughs> Boom, 17,000 level inflict wounds. No. No, I don't have anything. You respond to my message? In your head as you're sleeping? No, wow. what did you message me? Yeah. What did you message me? I sent, I sent a message through Whisper into your head. Hey, wake up. It's time. The festival's... <laughs> The, the festival, the festival, Jess starts jumping on you. <laughs> you can respond, but you whisper back if you want. has darkness on Jess. <laughs> so it's on you too, then. Yeah, I guess. Okay. Does that mean Kelly? And then she jumps <laughs> off your bed and starts poking your face till you wake up. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> wake up, wake up, wake up. Festival! <laughs> Fine. Uh, as you wake up, you don't see anything because you cast a darkness. You're right, and I don't break concentration just out of spite. But Jess keeps poking your face. I'm up. Because she can't I'm... see anything. I'm talking. <laughs> she keeps poking you. you I'm fully awake. Okay, she skips, she skips out of the darkness. And, jo and, and uh, wraps her arm around the Okimi. And drops her concentration on armor back list. <laughs> Wait, she had armor back at this time? Yeah, DM you and Joe saying that she cast an armor back at this. Oh, like, sorry, I was. I was um, sorting out fucking. I was sorting out the magic items. What? That's why the I said it would be funny if, if, you know, if uh, y'all could hit her. <laughs> Because he would have taken gold damage. Would have been funny. And I would have died on the spot. <laughs> she only casted it at first level. It only does like 10 minutes. I would have died on damage you her, right? I would have died on the spot. Okay. What if I kind of cold as you walk Anyways, <laughs> so you guys walk outside, there's a group of forests looking up at your castle going like whoa guys there's a little kid there's a little kid looking up at the castle at the keep whoa that's so cool i've never seen anything so big before and then the the, the keep stores open like, whoa and you guys walk out wow are you guys adventurers I've never seen a real adventurer before. I killed a child. No, I don't kill a child. <laughs> make an act back to take some trips. What? <laughs> you know, like, the, the movie where they all walk, the main characters walk out cool, and one person trips. <laughs> oh, do you trip? Yeah. <laughs> Did you? Nah, nah. I... No. Yeah, 21. Everyone needs to roll, roll an athletics or acrobatics check to see if anyone trips. <laughs> Jess definitely doesn't trip. It's setting a dangerous precedent here. Lowest roll of trips. No matter what. <laughs> 10. Yelkin is rolling on his face. Did Yelkin roll? No, no, I did. Um, I got a 25. Joe. So, as I fall, I start no, trying to No, you don't trip, it's the trips. Up. I also got a 10. Oh, so you guys both trip then. <laughs> yeah, but as I trip, I'm gonna start flying and I'm gonna fly into the air. So the it looks like I'm meant to do trip. that. Mommy, does that mean they're not adventurers? What kind of adventurer would trip? I don't know how I to do that. <laughs> I pull out my gun and start spinning it. Wow! <laughs> That's so- actually, roll performance. <laughs> Is there some darkness on Jess No. 23. Yeah, you start spinning your gun, he's like, Whoa! Mom, look at that! This guy's so cool! I wanna be an owl with that 
No way to be fair. This is a little human child. Oh man, I will. Oh, oh, I want to kill him so bad. Look how I'm flying! Oh, 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 oh. And then, and then, um, the mom's like, don't bother the nice people. And she keeps talking on the chair, and he keeps looking at you amazed. At yeah, all of you guys amazed. And Isbeth gets up and wipes off the dirt from her clothes. Can I cast lesser, can I cast lesser restoration on this child to try to cure them of their child? <laughs> to cure them of their child? Sure, you cast lesser, lesser restoration and the child looks even more amazed. He doesn't know what spell you cast, but he knows you cast the spell. Right, he, know, he doesn't know what to restore them of, but he knows I definitely restore them. Uh, so, what do you guys want to do first? Uh, let's get some carnival food, because we just broke up. Dude, funnel cake? Yeah, what I'm making breakfast. Make sure there's some uh, food on it. The, all the carnival food snacks and stuff are free. Dude. So, yeah, Congress. you guys. At, at least we for you guys. Um, it seems like they're charging anyone that isn't a resident of, of Golden Rock, but all the residents of Golden Rock get to eat for free. Nice. So you guys get to use for free. You see, you see, Pogto is the, is helping with um with making the food and Gunda as well. Let's go talk to Gunda. Uh, and the goblins. And, and, and his goblins are running around serving people, and some of them are running. One one or two of them are running carnival games. One of the one of the goblins is in the dunk tank. Fair. <laughs> I don't like it. I'm not, I'm not, I'm gonna just walk around with, um, Jess, whatever, she, whatever she wants to do. I wanna knock the goblin in the dunk tank. No, you don't. No, you're lying. She, why, she, why do you wanna so do you that? Get, the way the dunk tank works is you get three shots, uh, and you can add your strength or dexterity, no proficiency bonus. No accuracy from weapons? Well, it's not- the balls aren't a weapon. Oh, he didn't throw any ice super on you. Um, and the DC- the DC is 8- or is, uh, 15. So she misses the first shot. The first shot hits the- hits the glass of the dog tank. Jess, do you She misses the Jess. second shot, too, but almost hits Jess, it. Jess, do you want me to- do you want me to try the last dart? I mean, it doesn't cost any money. You can try after I'm done. Yeah, good point. And then she hits it, and this thing spins around four times, and the goblin falls in. Yeah, never mind, yeah. yeah. She got a natural one, a, uh, a 13, and then a natural 20. I'm <laughs> See, gonna I go help this. To, I just had to... to the, the, the first two are practice shots. Sam. Does anyone else want to... The goblin climbs back out. <laughs> And he's, his gloves are soaked all the way through. Next! Ah, <laughs> uh, fuck it, I'll, I'll give it a go. Stop bullying this child! Okay. 15! You knocked the goblin in, but you still have two balls, so he climbs back up. <laughs> you still have two four shots! Is it haggling on my yellow? 19? <laughs> He falls in again. And then climbs back out. Okay. One more shot. And 17. Ah! <laughs> he falls in again. Climbs out. His ears are like all the way back from how much water's on him. <laughs> I, I'm gonna look at Jess. So, what was that about practice shots? She punches you. <laughs> For no damage because she has a minus two to strike. That's funny. <laughs> um, and they give each of you uh, five copper pieces. Actually, no, you get you get fifteen copper pieces, Yoki. Because you you knocked him in five. Hey. Or three times. Fifteen copper. Want to give it a shot? You want to give it a shot? That. Okay. Or strength. 
I used Dex because it was better for me. So you missed the what, first what, one. What? 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 Oh. Ooh, oh man. I don't think Noah hit over there. Nope, you missed. Not on a row seven. Here. Where's that row again? There it goes. So you missed the second one, you missed it. And it it, it gotcha. knocked the, the target down. He's like, ah! Why did you guys have to be my first people to do the dunk tank? Do you want us to come back and do it later so you get wet again? When it gets warm? Oh, no, <laughs> just just take your last shot. So you missed all that time. Come on, come on. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm, I'm going to look at Joe. Come on, man. I'm, I'm, I'm smooth. Underhand. I'm smooth. I when I was doing it. Just that one underhand at it to give him a break. Yelkin, do you want to try? No, no, I don't want to try. <laughs> Why not? Why would I want to try? Isbeth will. Oh no, Isbeth is gonna blow this up and hark. Uh, Isbeth knocks him in the first time, and he he's about to get off and she get up and she throws again, and knocks him in again, <laughs> and then he's about to get up and she throws it a third time and knocks him in a third time. <laughs> So he's like, she doesn't even give him a chance to all the way get back up. It's just like, boom, 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 boom. Damn, that was harsh. Yeah. And so you can add five copper to your inventory. Oh, thanks. And Isbeth gets 15. Enjoy the festival. While spitting out water. <laughs> okay, what do you guys want to do next? I, I'm, I'm gonna give him a pat on the back. <laughs> you would have him. to fly over the tank to give him a pat on the back. Yeah, I'll, I'll fly over the tank and give him a pat on the back. Uh, he attempts to throw you into the water. <laughs> roll, roll an acrobatic <laughs> yeah, is, is this for grapple? Yeah. Cool, I get advantage. Squat nimbleness. Uh, 20. Um, so, for, since it's considered an attack roll, I think that goes to the goblin, because he also got a 20. Ooh. So, he, give the he pulls the you down, and you're all four. wet now, and he laughs. <laughs> and then he lets you go. I'm gonna laugh back at him and then get out. And shake the water off uh, my he, he gives you a handshake before you get out. Yeah. <laughs> that was a good one. That was a good one. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. This goblin's fucking evil, man. <laughs> so yeah, there's all sorts of games here for you guys to play. You guys want to keep uh, looking around? Yeah. There's, uh, there's a there nice is game. a check your, a check, one of the classic check your strength games. I want to do that. <laughs> you know what, this is, this is funny. I'm going to walk up to it, and I'm going to, um, like, I'm going to drink the potion of storm giant strength. Okay. <laughs> uh, Using the legendary potion. So it costs, it costs, um... Two copper to play, and you'll get gold depending. You'll get uh, copper depending on uh, what you roll. Right. So I drink the potion, walk up to it, and I give him two copper. Okay. Roll an athletics check. Yeah, that's twenty nine. Um, it, the thing, the little needle flies off the thing and into the air. And then comes back down. It, it just a little bit into the air. Um, and he hands you two platinum. Pretty impressive. Hey. Pretty impressive. 
Right, for the next for the next hour I'm gonna look for any of the other like strength based games. Yeah. And uh Jess should give you Bardic to min max. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot that that could, uh, that that could happen. That is plus, uh, there's four of us, right? Oh, yeah, and Isba. Do you guys want, do you guys want to do the, the, the check your strength game, too? Well, yeah. I don't want to have to follow up him. <laughs> <laughs> Not after what I just pulled. Um, Can I try to arm wrestle you, Kimi? Sure. <laughs> no, I'm I'll go for an arm wrestle. All okay, right. there is an area specifically for arm wrestling. Oh, okay. Is there? Yes, there's there's an arm wrestling tournament at uh tonight or in the afternoon at uh well actually you know what? No, it's actually about to start. Just so you know, can no. use the potion. Yes, just so I could use the potion. <laughs> And the prize, oh, the prize is, um, is a, is, um, a random trinket. So I'll, I'll roll Ooh. on the, on the trinkets table. Well, I'm going to use either the Wild Dawn with Light trinket, trinket table or the, uh, Fire Stand table. I'm going to roll to see which one it's from. So it could be, it could be any of those trinkets. Cool. I'm okay. going to go into the competition. Fuck it. But I, yeah, I want to also join, but what happens if he gets caught for doping? <laughs> what? Happens if he, what happens if he gets caught for doping? I think you should have to roll a sleight of hand with every, with every uh, competition. Why would I need to do it every competition? So that you don't get caught. Wait, what, what's I'm he just, trying to do? I, I'm sorry, I, I missed it. What? Hide the fact that he is blatantly on performance enhancing drugs. Oh, he doesn't need to do that. There's no way to tell. Where are... Besides the fact that he's a tiny little <laughs> bit. Besides, besides the fact that I'm a tiny fucking owlin. Just, just yeah. <laughs> with really, owlin. With besides really skinny like, fucking arms. Every single person. How many, how many rounds of the uh, arm wrestling is there? Um, um, there... So, Intis is here. And this is here, um, there's, there's this, uh, there's, hold on, let me get all of the entries, all the people who will be here lined up. We're gonna have Pogto be part of it. There's a big, strong Goliath man. So, hold on. Uh, I'm just gonna do this in the initiative tracker, I need to figure out who, who's competing first, though. Okay. So give me a second, give me a second to figure this out. <laughs> so we've got Pogto, we've got Intus. I don't think you need to roll initiative, Joe. You don't need to roll initiative, I'm just using the initiative tracker. <laughs> There's someone you've never seen before. She's a, um... She looks familiar. You, None of you have... You, you've definitely never seen her before, but she looks... Something about her face reminds you of someone you've met before. Um, but she's wearing. Hold on, I'll send you. I'll, I'll send a picture in the chat. Um, Is it another fucking Shadow Kai? No. Okay. Um, she looks like this. So she's wearing gold and silver armor and has purple hair. So, but something about her facial features reminds you of someone, but you can't quite place it. Um, do, do, do. Huh. And then, uh, you've got this big, strong Goliath man, and any of you guys that want to stand here. So there's four, there's four people besides you guys. No, I'm, I'm, in. I'm entering. He's entering. Joe, are you entering? No, no. Joe's in. It's Jess and, um... Uh, Isbeth will enter Jess one. The general yeah. guy. Yeah. So, Intis has... <laughs> and this will be this will be using your athletics. So, Intis has a... Cool. Five. 
I have a plus 12. <laughs> Oh, it's gonna be funny. Uh, and then the Goliath has the big Goliath man has a very high also. And then, Joe, what's your what's what's your athletics? That's fine. Hey. Um. And Yelkin, are you competing? Yelkin, yes. yeah. What's your athletics? Um, seventeen. So plus three. Yeah, plus three. Oh, do you not have proficiency in athletics? Oh, athletics plus six. I was thinking strength. Oh. Then we've got Yelkin. Oh. Plus six. Plus six. Yelkin. Six. And then, let's see. We've got Stella and Stella has a plus. You know, you know who I think this is? I think this is Zolus's wife. I don't know why. You looked at Zolus and thought that man was straight? <laughs> yes! <laughs> Mistake. Yeah. Ismith has the lowest, has the lowest of uh, anyone here. Well, yeah, because she's a ranger. Okay. She's not meant so, to be strong. First up, first up is... Um, Antis versus Yokini. Oh. <laughs> I'm, I'm just gonna say to him, good luck to you. Roll an athletic check against Antis. I don't want to for sure. I don't want to say this takes so long to get through all the final rounds. When he gets to the final round, Yokini's gonna run out of his potion. <laughs> <laughs> that would be pretty funny. What are you The final and it's just creamed. I rolled really poorly. 18. Antis beats you. Yeah. He rolled a 22. Yeah. So, first round, you, you guys you guys watch. You know that Yokimi just drank this potion. It just slams his arm into the table. Okay, Joe. It's you versus this big Goliath, man. Come on, Joe. Come on. Right? Or uh, athletics. Can I cast a blessing, Oh, Joe, oh God. 14. I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready. Yeah, he, oh, he slams your arm on the table. Okay. Can I persuade them? That was nerdy. Pogto versus Yelkin. Easy. Weak. <laughs> I roll first, right? Uh, I, I'm rolling at the same time. Oh, uh, so just, just roll. Yeah, just roll. <laughs> Alright. What'd you get? 21. Okay, you beat Pogto. No, 22, 22. You beat Pogto. This should be like a... Okay, Stella <laughs> versus Isbeth. That's so a this, three. This, this mysterious person versus Isbeth. That's an 18. And Isbeth gets a 7. So yeah, this this person that... This person that... Uh, this mysterious person that I sent you the picture of, she beats Isbeth. Uh, I should put her on the layout. Nah, it's fine. <laughs> Actually, yeah, I should put her on. She's kind of important, so we'll put her on. Don't <laughs> and... have Isbeth on there either. Isbeth, well, I'll get next session. Isbeth will be on there. Because she might be traveling with you guys. I've got all my luck points for today. I don't think I'm losing. <laughs> <laughs> you could totally still lose. Anyone have Bane? Hey, you yeah. killed my butt. Okay, and that, so Bane round two, uh, Antis versus the Goliath is the first match. Antis got a 15, and the, the Goliath got a 26, so... Jesus. The Goliath slams Antis' arm down. 
Uh, and then Yelkin versus this this um this mysterious cow. Mysterious character. Easy. We should have actually searched. No, I'm saying no. So I, I <laughs> want to be lucky, so you got an extra D4. Okay, what'd you roll? I got, um, what do I add? 25. I got a 25. Okay, you beat her. Wait, hold on. Can Easy. you do anything? Let's see. I don't think that helps, like, skills checks. That's why I keep looking for, like, Because you have your luck point. Let's see if she has something like that. She doesn't. So, yeah, you beat her. So, the final match, Yelkin versus this Goliath. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay Yelkin. Okay. He didn't roll super well. I rolled pretty good. Okay, 21. 22. So Ooh. this Goliath, this super bulky Goliath is like, Good luck, I don't think you'll- Oh shit, my arm! You broke my arm! <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna, I'm, is that actually broken? No way. No, it's not. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm gonna look at, um, at Yelkin. Okay, me, you, now. <laughs> the, ta- the, table, the table is broken, though. Right, Yogan, me, you, now. I want to see how strong you are. Easy. Easy. This is weak. <laughs> okay, you and Yogan lock hands. I'm going to have to. You and Yogan lo- lock hands. Uh-huh. Roll. And you immediately mm. realize your potion just wears out as soon as you lock hands. <laughs> Do you, Actually, you, know you don't, really you don't realize it is, but your potion wore off. No, um, do you know what's really funny? I now won as well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got a 21. <laughs> so yeah, uh, y- 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 y'all could accidentally put too much force in this, and now you keep keeping on the ground. <laughs> I basically got my fucking pants up and thrown to the floor. Like, Jesus I, Christ. I, I, he's on the floor and I still have his hand in my hand. I his hand in my pick him up by his hand to try to fix him because I forget he's so short. <laughs> so so now he's dangling. <laughs> I'm gonna pull out my pistol. Could you put me down, please? Yeah, I guess. And I drop him. I'm just gonna fly in the in where he win. I go. And Yalkin, you win. What do I win? A. Pixie plushie that sings when you squeeze it. Hmm. Yo. But what is evil, right? right? <laughs> Not gonna lie. I feel like that's something that Yelkin would actually enjoy. <laughs> I mean, I'm... <laughs> Say us a song. That's actually, that's actually kind of a cool thing. Okay. What do you guys want to do now? Pixie plushie. Man, Pixie's any artist. She's real hot right now in my traveling scene. Pretty lucky, Elkin. Okay. Um. Do you ever hear Pixie's songs? N- no. What, what What other things are on and around? There's, um. Like, the normal carnival stuff, there's some carnival rides. There's a, there's a circus, there's an eating, yeah, there's an eating contest. Is, it, is there an ale drinking contest? <laughs> you know what? Yeah, there yeah. totally is. Oh, I want to also do that. I'll, I'll, I'll join in whatever we're going to do. Um, Entis, Entis and Pogto and uh, Isbeth are all going to travel with you guys, too. So whatever you guys do. I'm Jess. Yeah. Oh, Jess is totally gonna compete in this drinking contest. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um. It's one of those oasis waters that gives it. Okay. Uh, you're not gonna come um, I actually want you guys to roll initiative for this, for the drinking contest. I should have had you do it for the last one. Um, don't add your dex mod, just roll a d20, actually. Oh, okay. For initiative. <laughs> Uh, nat 20. <laughs> um, by the way, I want to drink a bottle of Oasis water real quick. Okay. Oh, and shit! I'll, I'll, what, and I'm going to give one to Jess. Jess isn't going to drink it. 
I, I'm gonna laugh if it's the bubbles one. Just won't drink it though. Yeah. So Yokimi got a twenty. Um and Yokimi, what's your con modifier? Or your your con saving throw? Plus three. Okay. Uh, and actually, wait, I don't need initiative for this one, because it's not a one-on-one -on -one type thing. No, it's a... everyone around. Oh, actually, yes, I... Okay, never mind, yeah, I don't need initiative. Um, no, rounds. But I, I am gonna have you guys roll initiative anyway. Cool. Um, so that's a no, nine... Hey, don't add play. your dex mod. So, like I said. Yeah. Uh, I know Joe is competing. Is, uh, Yelkin competing? Yes, and we rolled the same one initiative. Okay. Who? Yelkin and Joe. Yeah, we both got a two. Nice. So, what's Pogtoe's on? Five. Pogtoe can hold Pogtoe's his liquor, apparently. Five? Jesus. Uh, and then Entis is Dang. You guys got two? Two. I'm so, I'm so average. Joe... What's your con, Joe? Your con mod? Plus two. Uh, that's the saving throw? No, the saving throw is plus five. Okay. Uh, and then... What's your con save, Yelkin? Plus three. Then, okay. So what I need you guys to all do now is roll a con saving throw. Um, can I have the um, Oasis Walker table, please? Oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, I just rolled it. Hold on. Just do. And that's 30. Which is uh, bubbles come out of your mouth whenever you talk to the next actor. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I assume that it's the drunk one, and I, I, I get ready. Okay, everyone roll a con saving throw. Got a twenty-two. A twenty-two. Thirteen. Oh, terrible today. Eighteen. So so far, Yelkin's winning. Still yelling. Oh, I like all of them. When am um, I ever not winning? Okay, Jess. Here we go. Yeah, on top. Okay, Yelkin wins again. Sigma male grind set. Uh, I, I, I go to speak to you, um, Yelkin, and then Bubbles come up my phone. Like, ah. Uh, uh, you stupid idiot. You're dumb. I just eliminate the lowest person each round. And Yelkin, you win goals. five. You win five gold. Actually, no, five platinum. You five get platinum. Five platinum and a tr another trinket. It's gonna be something. <laughs> oh no! Can't wait. Where's the trinket table in the player's handbook? I like random tables. Can you guys tell? The, the player's handbook one is a lot less interesting. The Feywild one has... Some very interesting ones, yeah. Well, I'm rolling to see which, which table it is between the two, so... That's unfortunate. One? You, you get a Does glass have... orb filled with moving smoke. That's kind of sick. Smoke you got two of the, I feel like you got two of the better... Two of the better trinkets there. Yeah. You could have like, like a painted skull of a goblin or something. Yeah, so yeah. I would freak out if I got that. But um. Okay, what do you guys want to do now? The, all all the carnival games are gonna be skill checks. This kind of this orb would be sick. You know, if I it would be a sick paperweight if I knew how to read. <laughs> oh, and if you, guys, if you guys want there to be a, some kind of competition, ask, and more than likely I'll just come up with an ability check. <laughs> I'm gonna warn we have to move our hands a lot, like slam our hands. Like, uh. Ooh. 
Wait, what what about one of those ones where they have the three cups and one of them has a ball in it and they, they absolutely around? have that. That would be a oh, yeah. Deck. Yeah, I'm I'm doing that one. Deception shirt. Yeah, it's two it's two it's two copper to play. Um and it's a very high DC. Copper. Three copper, I'm in. Okay, roll yeah, I'm in. I don't have copper, can I just give them a whole gold? <laughs> I, 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 I get <laughs> I'm just gonna say, I can just give him the. They'll give, give you, they'll give you um, nine silver back uh, and eight copper. So, first, Yokimi, what's your perception roll? Uh, 15. Fuck. Yeah. Is it perception? You, you don't get it. He moves around the uh, things way too fast and you lose track of the ball. I'm gonna lose a deception. No, no perception. <laughs> Oh well, I'm gonna lose mine, I guess. I mean, he's a lot of points. I rolled a four. I, I. Okay. By the way, when, when, um, when, um, Yellow can walk past me, I'm gonna tap him and cast hex. <laughs> hey, guess what? I, uh, I just used my first luck point of the day. Okay. Cool. I You're cast hex on you and target wisdom. Oh wait, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter because uh, if he uses luck point, he can use luck point instead. Oh yeah. Because luck is broken. Yeah, I got a 23. Nope, you lose track of the ball. <laughs> this is not realistic. This game's so easy. In the it really isn't. It, no, it really it's depends. It, 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 it does depend. Thing. This guy, uh, Jess is going to play. This guy, or actually, uh, Joe, do you want to do it first? Oh, I just failed. Hey, this, oh, uh, what was it? Seven, I think. You got a you seven. Got eight. 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 You, so you you, you yeah. can't keep track of it. Jess couldn't keep track of it. Um, Isbeth will try. There's a deception check. So yes. Isbeth will try it. She fails too. And her perception is a plus nine. My perception huh? is a plus seven. My perception is plus five. I just rolled. Hey, get up. <laughs> plus one. Intis will try to. I rolled high by choice. Intis will fail. Pogta will try to. Pogta will fail. And then this this lady from the eating contest before watches um, and gets it. Um, I'm going to sleight of hand a feather into her pocket. Okay. That's sick. Roll side of hand check. <laughs> <laughs> what was it? Not one! <laughs> Can I watch one for him? She grabs the feather. No, actually, no, she grabs your hand. I wouldn't do that for you. I know exactly what that is. I, I go to speak and bubbles come out of my mouth. No, the bubbles, that's over now. <laughs> oh, that's a shame. I wanted to still be there. <laughs> Don't, don't even try that. Don't try what? She looks, she's still holding your hand with the feather in it. Yeah? Well, your wrist. Yeah. Don't try what? She looks at the feather. Wait, do I know Yokimi, um... I would prefer, I would prefer not to be tracked. I wasn't gonna track you. Well, then what were you gonna do with that? Every Hexblood I've met has either tried to track me and kill me, or just said weird things in my head. Message. I can say weird things in your head, too. <laughs> she pulls out her sword. <laughs> I just turn away. <laughs> me, too. The, the, the deception? I mean, the, the, the... if you want to get physical, I summon the Raven's Rapier into my other hand. Her if eyes widen at the Raven's Rapier. Where did you get that? Oh, it's mine. It, 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 I make it disappear. I've only heard of weapons like that before. So who are you? My name is Stella. Nice to meet you. Can, can you let go of my wrist, please? Oh, sorry. <laughs> it's all good. Uh, um, two, two armored people walk up behind her. Captain, we should keep looking. I don't see... I don't see your father anywhere around here. 
I'm good at finding people. Can I kill Paul Pellegrin? Paul Pellegrin, you ever keep me in a slight hand into a pocket? <laughs> that, that's, that's not how it works. <laughs> Uh, I know zero intelligence. Um, you know what? Fuck it, yeah. <laughs> you talk a feather from me, try and slide a hand into uh, I appreciate, it. I appreciate the offer, but I don't know how much help you can be. I don't, I'm not even sure he's alive. A 21. Do you know who your father, what your father's name is? Can I try to, can I try to, uh, slip, uh, Mike Wall's feather token into her pocket? <laughs> sure, I'll slide a hand. <laughs> I got a 21 to slide one of his fellows like 20 times. You want to know what my, you want to know what my mom did? Uh, first of is? all, Joe, I didn't say you yeah. could do that. You can't do that. <laughs> what, did, what did you roll? I got 15. Yeah, you, you slide your thing into her pocket. She doesn't notice. <laughs> okay, and then I walk away, turn around, and wink I, at her. I, I, I like how, no, I notice, and it's like, because the guards definitely noticed too. No, no, I noticed because I've got a passive perception of 17. The guard, no, the guards didn't notice. No way. Okay. Um. So. Well, we're gonna pull my, my, my father's name. My father's name is was a Risper. A Risper. Yeah, a uh, Risper. Oh, yeah, he's dead. Mm. Oh yeah, he he died. He fully dead. Mm. Oh, I, resurrection! Oh, I, I, I can, I can confirm that for you. I haven't seen him in so long. I was hoping that I'd be able to find him here. It's been about ten years since he left the Shadowfell, or at least ten years of my time. I don't know what that would be this time. Wait. I'm trying to think about whether it was... I'm trying to think about whether Yaz told me about the whole thing that happened. I think he did. I'm pretty sure he did. I'm not from around here. Huh. Captain, we should get going. She holds up her hand. No, I want to get these people out. And then so, the guards stand up. And also, the the yeah. embleming on their on their um, armor is nothing like you've ever seen before. So also not like what I saw when I saw into Strahd's castle. When you what? When I saw into Strahd's castle when um, the whole dream thing happened when I got the sword. Oh um. Hmm. Maybe actually, yeah, no, yeah, th you remember that and that, not anything directly related with Strahd himself, but some it, it reminds you of some kind of opposing force to Strahd. Hmm. It, it, uh, I, it, it's a Barovian guard emblem. Uh, okay. Specifically, I, you wouldn't know this, but specifically from the city of Block. Cool. So, do you want the long story or the short story of what happened? Long, but we should probably sit down for this. Guard, yeah, that's I, want, a good guard idea. I want you to return home immediately. I intend to stay for a while. Um, Clarence, you're in charge of the guard until I get back. The, one of the guards nods and they leave. Alright. Um, yeah, follow me, I guess. Um, I'm going to walk over to a more quiet area. Pogto and Intus are still with you guys, and Isbeth are all still with you guys, by the way. Yeah, no, they, they can <laughs> come with if they want. Okay. And, y'all kid, you're still just wandering around. Yeah. What about Joe? Mm, I'm looking around looking else. for more games to win. Okay. Yeah, I'm walking around with y'all kid. Okay, we'll start with we'll, we'll start with Yokimi and then we'll move on to what you guys are doing. Yeah. Um. So, Arisa helped us. Um. So, uh, how much am I allowed to say? I, I I look I look at my I summon the sword in my hand. 
Wait, no, she won't respond to me. I'd, I'd make it disappear. Fuck, I need Joe here. Right, uh, doesn't matter. That would just say the whole story because it doesn't really matter. So, we were protecting things, um, and Arispa helped us um, take back Golden Rock after it was not Golden, destroyed. Just, just wondering, Golden Rock's here? Yes, this is, this this is Golden, Golden Rock. I, I, this, this is, is Golden my, Rock, yeah. This is my first time in the Ethereal plane. It's very colorful compared to where I'm from. What does that word mean? If you think if you think this is colourful, you should see the Feywild. Actually, you won't see the Feywild that got destroyed. It's kind of honestly, all the colours and sounds are kind of overwhelming. Fair, um, but yeah, um, Arispa helped us take back here after it was taken over by was it Shadokai? Not Shadokai. What were they? Weird dragon things. The dragon people. Abishai. Yeah, the weird dragon. Abishai, that's one. Abishai. Yeah. Um, and after we got the, um, after we got the town sorted out, um, a big fuck off red dragon appeared. Um, and killed a Rispa and cut a hole in the dimension and went somewhere else. Huh. Well, I guess my trip here was for nothing. I should probably return back home. So your only reason for coming here was to find- give me a second. Even okay, so what were you saying? Um... To her? Was the only, was the only reason that you came here to find Arisva? Yeah. Huh. I haven't seen my dad in years. I just wanted to see him. Yeah. Um. I would say he's in the Shadowfell, but he's not. Um. I don't know where the fuck he is. Um. I just wanted I to know him. why he abandoned me and my mom. I don't think he abandoned you and your mum. I think you're reading the situation wrong. Okay. Well, I should probably return back to the Shadow Bell. Uh, to man, uh, to Captain, um, we've got a slight problem. Uh, we can't return. The gate seems to have closed. Well... I guess I'm not going home. I can travel between trees. I don't think that helps here. You're also not here. <laughs> Are there no trees in the Shadowfell? I you don't think you know of any trees. I don't think you know of any trees in the Shadowfell. a really good picture, it would work. Nope. You have to have seen the tree yourself before. <laughs> Anyways, um, um, so I guess I'm here now, um, <sighs> enjoy the rest of the festival, it was nice meeting you. Yeah, if you need something, let us know. She seems upset and frustrated and stands up and walks away. The guards follow her. I look over at Jess. Did I do something wrong? No, I don't think so. Oh, okay. I think she's just probably frustrated about this whole situation. Yeah, probably. I'll see if I can ask the Raven Queen about it. I don't know if the Raven Queen has any say over Raven. I don't think she does, but still. She's, she lives in the Shadowfell, so maybe she knows what's happening. Okay. Or what happened with, um, Arista. Okay. Yeah, that sounds good. We probably can't do that until tonight, though, right? Nah. Okay, well, we should go find Joe and Yalkin. Okay, guys, what are you doing? Yalkin and Joe. Um... Mm. Do you want to bet on the snail races? <laughs> no, not even, like, a little bit, actually. <laughs> we should ride the snail races. No. Animal handling checks. 
Actually, wait, let me make sure there's no way to win. Rig the snail race first. What? Let me make sure there's no way to rig the snail snail race first. There's no way to rig the snail race. There's always a way to rig the snail race. Rig the snail race. One of the snails. I can cast Crown of Madness on one of the snails. <laughs> make that one. Just make it. Has a heart attack mid race. Oh fuck! Well, we lost one. No, Why don't you want to it. watch the snail races? That sounds inexplicably boring. Okay. Um. Trying to think of other games that might be about. Is there a sharpshooting contest? Kind of. It's like or a water some... gun thing. Yeah, that. Yeah. Cool. I want to do that. <laughs> okay. 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 That. That'll be two copper per person. We need four people before we can start. Uh. Winner will get, um, a silver, and um. <laughs> And a prize. Is that a sharpshooter? Do they have like a batting cage? <laughs> uh, yeah. Can I go, can I go practice that swing? Uh, sure. Wait, what is this for? Let's go. So you guys yeah, are going... Yogan is not canonically a baseball So I, I'm, I'm doing the shoot the water gun game that you'd find in a normal carnival. And Je I guess Jess, Pogto, and Intus are there, so yeah. Isn't, um, Isbeth there as well? Oh, yeah. I guess Isbeth, Jess, Isbeth and Jess will fight. Pogto and Intus aren't interested in that. And we'll call this, for accuracy, call it Sleight of Hand. Well, I'm playing. Okay, you go find them. Can I can I use like so what is it that we're actually doing? Um, YouTube music, okay. <laughs> uh, okay, there we go. Um, is it actually like shooting a? You're shooting a target. <laughs> with... Slide a hand check. Do any of us have shape water? If you have if you have the sharpshooter feet. Like is this does, then you do it with it. Okay. And if you have the if you have the archery fighting style too, you can add plus two. I don't think no, anyone has the archery fighting nope. style. No archery. Okay. So is this Jess, Joe, and uh, me? Yoki. Everyone roll a chat. Slide a hand. Okay, I'm happy with that. Oh, okay, Joe. Oh wait, no. You get advantage, Joe. Yeah. Why do you get advantage? Um, from my vested I don't know. I still beat you. That's funny. Okay. Um, the high just got a a sixteen. Um, Isbeth got a seventeen. I got seventeen. And an 18, so that's plus 2 from archery. You have the archery sign, oh, no. Yeah. Okay, well, well I guess Joe, what? Joe wins. Yeah, Joe wins by one. Did you guys all, did you guys all remove two copper? I removed two copper. Um, and Joe, you removed two copper mm -hmm. and half silver. So they're just losing money here. Well, no, because in total, because we're all friends, no. we just made two copper. No, no, no. no, the people running the thing are losing money. Oh, yeah. And they're making money from non residents on food. And Joe, yeah. you also get. An item. You get. A. A pair of green leprechaun boots tied together by their laces. Hope I find a leprechaun with no shoes on. <laughs> no straight for his pot of gold for his shoes. Okay, um... Yeah, Yelkin, you're, you're doing a... 
competition, a, a baseball type thing. Um, <laughs> yeah, actually, I'm third baseman for the Mets, so. <laughs> this will be a athletics chat. Um, and if you successfully hit three out of five, so it's, it costs two hopper, two copper. If you successfully hit three out of five, um, then you will get a silver and a and a trophy. Okay, this is weak. <laughs> You're saying that about everything. <laughs> well, consider they're Roll weak. Five checks. Probably the number. Check. Five Athletics. what checks? Athletics. Athletics? This is even weaker than I thought. One. First one is 16. So you missed the first ball. I'm going to use a lock point on that. There's no way. Um, that's 14. You missed the first ball. I missed the first and second ball. Oh, I thought you used the lock point. Not on the first one. I oh. rolled and then used the lock point on the oh, one. Okay. And, and so on yeah, you missed the first and the second one. Alright, let's see. Um, number three is a 20. Okay, so you hit the third one. You have to hit every single one, Yogan. You have to hit the last two. Number four is a natural 20. Okay, you hit the second one, or you hit the fourth one, I mean. So that's two. You have to hit this last one. Number five is a 25. Okay, you hit three, so you get a silver and a trinket. You hit three out of five. And you get the silver pine cone in addition to the silver. Dude, again, another amazing paperweight if I knew how to read. <laughs> <laughs> Too bad, you don't know how to read. And read it's about bad. it's about sundown now, and there is fireworks going off, signaling the end of the first day of the festival. Yeah, I'm actually hitter for the Cubs, so um, thank God that finally pulled so off. So you guys meet up, meet up for dinner and stuff before you head to bed. Yeah. Are you going to eat back at We'll go to the main. No, the main hotel is going to be full of shit. Yeah, the main hotel is very crowded. Yeah, no, we'll, we'll eat at the keep, I think. Unless people want to go to the main hotel. Uh, well, Parksha left a while ago. Because he had to go deal with the main hotel stuff. <laughs> yeah. Um, Entis, Entis went back to his place also. So it's just his bit, uh, Jess and then you guys. <laughs> So, Yelkin and Joe, are you guys going back to the keep or are you going to eat at Pasta? I'm going back to the keep. Keep. Okay, you guys all go back to the keep. Um, Isbeth offers to cook for you guys, so up to you guys whether you take that offer or not. Oh, fuck it, go for it. Uh, so Isbeth <laughs> cooks a meal for you guys. It's pretty, pretty average. Dude. Yoken's just been acting the whole day like he knows who his Beth is. He does not. <laughs> Wait, he doesn't. He, is this the first time he's met his Beth? He's never met this person. Yeah, this, this is the first time that they're actually like met. Oh, his Beth is a no. Oh. She, uh. Small girl. Oh, Small girl. What do you know? Huh? <laughs> oh, fuck's sake. No. Do not start with known hands, please. She's a ranger gnome that saved Yaz's life like three times. Ah, okay, got it. Yeah. Anyway, you know and, I bet. Yeah, and she was all, she was a member all, of the the once uh, guest investigators group, which is now disbanded because half the members are dead. I bet those times when Yaz almost died, he was like, "Oh gnome." <laughs> 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 Yeah, can I strangle Yelkin? Okay. You can try. Yes, you can, you can certainly <laughs> try. 
Um, is there anything else that you guys want to do throughout the festival? Otherwise, we can skip through this festival and end session there for the Dragon Games next session. I'll just spend some time with Jess, I guess. Uh, do you guys want to do any more carnival games for the next couple days? Um, I've already played a few each day, but like, nothing really that. Okay, what, uh, yeah, what, what games do you want to play what days? We'll, we'll just do some skills checks for, uh, for all the games you guys want to play. No. Or you can give me a skill and I can come up with a game that would use that skill. They have any usable skills. Oh, Stealth. Animal, animal handling. Animal, animal handling? Yeah, animal handling. You should have done this. I you mean, there, the there's a sign up for a dragonfly race. Yes. Do you guys want to participate exactly. in the dragonfly race? I didn't know. Yes. Okay. So, how this is going to work is it's going to be a series of checks. Uh, the first check is animal handling. The second check is athletics. The third check is animal handling again. And then the fourth check is acrobatics. Buddy, you've made a mistake here. Like, and whoever, so rolls, whoever, whoever rolls the highest on all four checks will win the race. It's, right, so it's animal handling, mm -hmm. athletics, animal handling, acrobatics. Yes. Okay. And then you can describe how you're riding the dragonfly. <laughs> okay. That's an interesting set of rolls. I'm doing really good so far. <laughs> now let Joe get his in. So I'm gonna wait for yours so they're all nice and together. Yeah. Alright. Alright. Well, my last one was pretty shit. <laughs> I used to have 20 to finish. Oh, wait. Yeah, Joe wins. wins. Wait, this is a different day, so I've got more luck. Points. This is a different day, so I've got more luck. Yeah, this is another day. This is day two. No, I point that. That's a nat 20. Question. Alright. Could, could I improve any of these roles by casting Speak with Animals? Uh, advantage on the animal handling check. Okay, so no. then do I get immediate advantage since I can speak with animals by default? Actually, yeah. <laughs> Easy. So yeah, I will cast speak with animals then. Okay, so that's my athletics. Uh, so that's my that athletics. That'd be the first one. I mean, that is better. Is my the second one. First. Is 20 again. Okay. So I'm. Instead, I'm 28, 20, 19. Hold on, wait. I'm about to win. Hold on. <laughs> so. Um, yeah, I win. Um, sorry. You win? Yeah, I win. So I got a... My animal handling is plus 8. So that's okay. a 25 for the first animal handling. Mm -hmm. My athletics is a 24. Okay. My second animal handling is a 26. Okay. And my acrobatics is a nat 20. Well, you beat... You beat... Uh, is this Jess and the other NPC that was... Uh, no, every, the, every, he beat everyone. How the fuck? He beat everyone. So, uh, describe how you maneuver this dragonfly outfit. Oh yeah, he has luck. I have I used a luck point on my acrobatics. I rolled a good for my athletics and I had advantage on both animals. Yeah. Describe how you're maneuvering this dragonfly as this as you get into this race with this master dragonfly handler. I just laugh at him. I'm just like naturally faster, I guess, because I'm so amazing. And I just like I'm like in front of him, just pointing at him and laughing. He's a hobgoblin, and he's wearing these these big dragonfly goggles. I was like, "Dragonfly." <laughs> you look like an idiot, dude. <laughs> you look stupid. 
<laughs> um, and the reward, the uh, oh, it costed five copper to enter this, by the way. So everyone removed five copper. Got it. Um, but Yelkin, you get ten platinum. Jesus. Yes, I do. Um, and also they're getting, by the way, they're, they're getting money for, um, for people watching this, the races and stuff, too. They have admission for tickets and stuff. Um, yeah. so you get 10 platinum, and you get to keep the dragonfly. The, the dragonfly? Yeah, that you were riding on. <laughs> so he got a new mount, nice. You have a giant, you have a giant dragonfly now. How do I even do something like that? How do I add that? Um, if you go to X oh. first... Um, you now have a creature that has a 60 foot fly speed. Wait, what? Um, so if you go to extras... Mm -hmm. Go to manage extras... Yeah. Um, then hit add an extra mount, and then type in dragonfly. Got it. And then you'll see giant dragonfly. And your dragonfly is even bigger than a normal giant dragonfly. This is easy. Easy. This is me now. <laughs> so yeah, you have a creature with an AC of 16, hit points of 22, and a fly speed of 60. Nice. His name's gonna be Yarn Mega. <laughs> oh, you piece of shit. <laughs> is, uh, do you guys want to watch the, the carnival to the circus? Thing, show? No, what am I doing? His name's gonna be Flygon. I'm stupid. <laughs> Flygon's not a dragonfly. Yes, it. It isn't. I will fight both of you. I don't know what it is, Make but it's you. not a dragonfly. You, Vibrava, idiot. Well, my Brava is a dragonfly. Flygon is not a dragonfly. Yeah, and then Flygon's a bigger dragonfly. <laughs> Nope. No, Flygon no. is a... Hold on. Flygon is a, um... That was just flying to Flygon's a mystic Pokemon. Is the mystic Pokemon? It's not a dragon fly. It's just it's a, a magical dragon Pokemon? thing. It's just a magic. Yeah, magical it, is, cool. it, it is the mystic Pokemon. Y'all are weird. <laughs> I was hoping it would say an animal when I looked up Flycon, but I mean, no, it's the mystic You want to know what's really funny? You want to know what's really funny? My brother is the vibration Pokemon. Yes, because they come from Trap Pinch, which is a fucking bad word. No, it's an ant pit. No, that's, that's an ant pit. Ant pit, or what's it called? Ant lion, that's what it is, an ant lion. <laughs> no, it's an ant pit, not an ant lion. <laughs> yes, an ant lion and an ant are the same bug. No, they're not. It's an ant pit. I will fight you right here. Like, Do you guys want to watch the circus? For example, like, Do you guys want to watch the circus? No. Does Jess want to watch the circus? Yes. Fine. And so does Isbeth. Joe, I'll are go you going to watch the circus? Yeah, everyone else is going. It's two copper for entry to the circus. So, everyone removed two copper from your character, except for Yelkin, who decided not to go. I've been upset. <laughs> um, so, the circus is really cool and really awesome. There's lions and giants and a whole a giant snails and more giant dragonflies. A whole bunch of Feywild creatures are in the circus. Um, it's like there's a unicorn. There's some fairies flying around. It's really pretty and cool looking to watch. Uh, and that ends off the Dragon Festival going into the, uh, the Dragon Games tomorrow. And, oh, by the way, every night has those same fireworks show. <laughs> on, on one of those nights, me and Jess are gonna um, sit on the balcony of the four. Just one of them? 
I assume that that would be something you would do for a lot of them. Probably. I'm just specifying for one of them, definitely. Okay. And what are Joe, are Joe and Yelkin doing anything special on any of the Joe and Yelkin are sitting on the balcony watching the fireworks. What? <laughs> Not <gonna try>. <laughs> Joe, Joe and Yelkin are sitting like, on the balcony watching the fireworks. They're like, they're like, they're cuddled on the roof. <laughs> the night that, that he's not there, we're cuddling on Yaz's tower. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Isbeth, Isbeth shot this rope on the top of Yaz's tower. You guys fired the top of, to the top no, of Yaz's no, tower. I romantically flew Joe up there on, on top of my dragon. <laughs> oh yeah, you got of your dragon. On top of the dragon <laughs> Yeah. So you guys yeah, just hide so at the bad. top of Yaz's tower and watch. Yaz is being this introvert the entire festival. That's funny. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> and and uh, are you guys also just staring at your your TV and Jazz from above them? <laughs> <laughs> That's something that Yoko would do. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's definitely a Yoko move. Um, you notice on the last night when you and Jess are sitting watching the fireworks, these little, these little fireflies start, start flying around you, in a five foot radius around you. Uh, me and Jess? Yeah. Oh, okay. But every time they get close, your hands face through them. That's cool. They're not real, is what I'm saying. I, I, I could gather that, but that is still cool. And it's I'm not Jess. Go. And it's not Jess. And uh, it's not Jess. Yelkin, Yelkin and Cho, you would see um, is the casting minor illusion from the top of the Every time, every time the, uh, the fires go off, I'm playing, I'm casting Thunderclap on top of the guys' tower. <laughs> and down, like, so it's just... I mean, I'm far enough away because he's like a three story tower, right? So he's yeah. only does damage to punish me. So it's like down above. <laughs> oh, so you're yeah, just making and... a ton of noise on the top of his tower? Yeah, so it, it's like aimed down at Yo it's a, aimed down at Yokimi. <laughs> so like, it's just like a stupid noise. Like every time the firework goes up, it's like boom! We're just like shaking everything. <laughs> So they're about to kiss, and then you just go, oh. <laughs> <laughs> What would be funny is that, like, that would happen. You would, like, pull out the gun and just fire a fireball off at Joe. It's like, fuck this. <laughs> <laughs> just completely blindly, he wouldn't actually be looking. He would just, okay. like, point it at the general direction of where he is and you just almost fire. Hit, you almost hit his death one time. Do you want to know what's funny? So I rolled at disadvantage to hit. I got a nat 20 and a 5. <laughs> yeah, you almost hit this this one time. The bunch like creeped over the side looking. What's Yelkin doing during all of this? Yelkin just had to go. Oh. So Yelkin, Yelkin's just staring. <laughs> He's amazed with the fireworks. He's never seen anything so big and beautiful. True. Um, then, late at night after the yeah. fireworks and the festival stuff are over, you hear a knock on your door. On our door? Um, yeah, on the keep shore. Okay. Um, I'm gonna, like, jump off of the roof and land next to... No, you guys are already the, inside uh, at this point. This is oh, the okay. The fireworks. I'll go open the door then. Fuck it. I'll, you see, I'll be the, one you that see the guards from before, the, the Barovian guards. And Stella. Oh hi. Hello. I didn't know. I didn't know where else to go. Uh, do you guys mind if we stay here? Yeah, come on in. There's, yeah, we're we're told, we were told that we could find you here. Yeah, there's um, there's some spare rooms at the top. Uh, is this just the okay. upstairs? And with that, I think we're gonna end the session there. Thank you guys for tuning in and watching the stream on YouTube. I hope you guys enjoy it, and we'll see you guys in the next one.